Hey there and welcome to my channel. My name is Gina and on this channel I talk about writing, entrepreneurship and living a creative lifestyle. So I've actually been working from home slash remote slash online since about 2018. And one of the things that has really, really helped me since then is actually setting the intention to work throughout my day. And one of the major things is actually getting ready, taking a shower, putting on clothes, putting on my makeup. It really sets the tone of the day for me. I don't always put on makeup, but some days, especially if I'm gonna be on calls and such, it's just nice to look nice when I get on the call. So I usually will start my work from home day with that, just getting ready and um, once that is done, um, I'm currently uh, doing intermittent fasting. So I'm doing like a 16 hour fast and then eight hours of eating. So I'm not actually going to have breakfast. And so I'm sitting right here in my home office currently. So now that I am sitting in my home office, actually, um, I will show you a few things. So here is, so here is a, um, a planner. I don't know if you can see a planner that I got from Target 2021. Um, I currently I I spilled some <laughs> some juice on it, so um, it is kind of messy. I use this planner um, throughout my day to track the different tasks I need to do in a particular day. I find that I'm much more productive if I write like the top three or four things I have to do in a day. I'm more likely to check them off, more likely to get them done. Um, and so I keep this planner right here. It's also helpful for me to kind of have a monthly overview of what I want to do. So you're probably thinking, so what do you do? Well, I am a scientific and medical writer and um a few things i have on my agenda today number one is to train uh two of my team members on a piece of software that we use for keyword research for writing blog content um i also have to read over an article i wrote yesterday and make sure it looks good before i send it over to um, my other colleagues for them to proofread it before we send it over to the client and then i want to brainstorm some um, social media ideas for the marketing agency that I work for. So it's going to be a full and busy day. I'm looking forward to it. So let's do this. So a little bit of a desk tour. Uh, this is my desk. I have my work computer, which is a MacBook Pro uh, connected to an Acer um, display. I also have my personal computer on the other side of this desk. And then on the other side, I have this, um, I don't know, rolly drawer thingy that contains odds and ends that I tend to use in my office as well as a printer. I don't know what this cup end is doing there, but anyway, <laughs> I'm ready to get started with work. Thirty-one p.m. So I'm gonna go ahead and have some lunch. And for lunch, I'm having this delicious smoothie that my husband made me. And I'm also gonna have this leftover shepherd's pie. It's so good that my husband made for me yesterday as well. I'm looking forward to this.
as I go back into work, I um, need some uh, <laughs> hydration. So here I am just filling my cup with some sparkling water. Let me tell you something. Okay. I love sparkling water. Let me know if you are a fellow sparkling club soda kind of person because I totally am. <laughs> this is the only way I'll drink water. After lunch, I typically just keep on working. I'll usually have things to read, write, edit during this time. Um, and so I do it during this time. And also when I come to the end of my day, I really do like to like turn the computer off and actually have a stopping time. It can be so tempting to continue working because you work from home. I, have, I tried my hardest to avoid that. So, yep, turning everything off. Yep, 9 to 5 is over, but I do run a business. I run a book coaching business. And um, I spoke with somebody yesterday that is interested in working with me. I feel so blessed because this year especially, people have reached out about my book coaching and I'm just so grateful. Um, so anyway, I need to send them an email as well as an invoice so we can kickstart our coaching relationship but before i do that i'm starving i'm hungry not starving but like i'm hungry and it's 5 45 and like i was telling you earlier <laughs> i am doing intermittent fasting so i do stop eating before 7 p.m so i try to eat what i'm gonna eat by 7 so that i can let my belly rest so i'm gonna do that first it's about 5 45 p.m and yeah let's do that let's eat some dinner so another thing i love to do is like just light a candle at home it just makes everything smell so good and for dinner today we're eating salmon a salad and some wachi which is a traditional Ghanaian dish so good lean into this so good after this um i just hang out with the family so i'm in the middle of reading a novel i'm actually rereading the novel and uh, there's my husband, um, you know, also relaxing after a long day of uh, work as well. Um, and we just essentially chill, um, spend our evenings just relaxing or doing things that, um, that excite us and make us happy. Another thing we like to do before we go to bed, it really is to have some tea. We love lemon, we love having apple cider vinegar, we put different things in our tea. Let me know, again, are you a tea drinker? Okay, let me know, I'm, a, I'm an avid tea drinker. I can't stand coffee. <laughs> I can't. Anyway, thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed watching this if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up below and leave us a comment and let us know that you enjoyed watching this all right talk to you soon <laughs>